Andrew Antonelli has been officially sworn in as Ipswich's 50th mayor. There was plenty of emotion on display after a tumultuous three months for the region, triggered by the shock resignation of longtime mayor Paul Pasali. Bearing the weight of Ipswich on his shoulders, <laughs> Andrew Antonelli is now the 50th name to be engraved on the city's mayoral chains. Congratulations, Mr Mayor. Thank you. Under the watchful eye of the Deputy Mayor, Councillor Antonelli was officially sworn in as the city's new leader, showing plenty of emotion during the ceremony. He used his first press conference to address the impending closure of two of the city's meat processing plants. Even if we come to Christmas and some of those people are struggling badly, the churches and other community groups of the city will rally behind and help those families. I know that. That's why I'm proud of this role. With his wife and daughters by his side, Mayor Antonelli promised to restore trust and pride in the region. It has just been a really hectic couple of months and um, now we've got a big job ahead of us and we're not going to let him switch down. His appointment comes after the shock resignation and subsequent criminal charges against former Mayor Paul Pasali, who is now in a Brisbane mental health facility. Is that good? Speaking publicly for the first time, Charlie Pasali said his brother's suffering poor health. Unfortunately, he just did too much damage to himself. He hit the wall. Now he's paying the price. So, you know, obviously, there's a lot of silly mistakes in there as well. I think there are some big challenges to overcome, but I think we're, we're, we've hit rock bottom. All we've got to do as a council, as a community, work together, and we'll not only come back to where we were, but we will exceed it. Mayor Antonelli says the people of Ipswich will see dramatic changes in governance by Christmas. Melanie Vujkovic, ABC News, Ipswich.